I want to appreciate every one of us that come very early, and I want us to be seated for me while as I'm encouraging us. Um, I know the church will become so big one day in Jesus' name, uh, and the grace of the Lord will be upon us in Jesus' name. We have heard a lot of things about uh, Baba Lola. We heard a lot of things about John Wesley. We read a lot of things about when they went through before story tell about them. I know by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, the story we tell about me too in Jesus' name. Uh, we know what they went through. Uh, but uh, Pastor, that I always tell us one thing that uh, whatever we are doing, let us make sure we do it well. Let's say we have appointment with the doctor. No matter what the circumstances may be, either we go to work, either we, we sleep at home, either we have one thing or the other, we don't miss that appointment. If either somebody beat us or somebody scold us, we don't miss that appointment. And uh, Pastor, that I always make that one as an example for us, that if we can respect doctor's appointment, why shouldn't we respect God's appointment for any situation, for any circumstances? And God is going to help us in Jesus' name. The grace of the Lord will be upon us in Jesus' name. Uh, I have a grace in the Lord that I never give a damn. I don't let him go. Except whatever God does not want me to achieve. Uh, and as a result of this, I just want you to know, the Palababu Church, we will continue to move forward in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, for the children, you may not know how I use my life, which I want to train you today as part of what I use my life. Even when I was working as a part-time worker, I make sure that eight hours is for what the work, eight hours for the home, eight hours to sleep. Among those eight hours, eight hours I cannot lose is eight hours for the work. So I make sure that because there's nothing I can want to tell my managing director and I'm not going to do, do use eight hours. And then uh, eight hours for rest, it's hour for that's it's hour for rest, it's hour for home. I can take that one. I can take either four hours, four hours from there to go to school. I have liberty to use that 16 hours. And then uh, my wife can buy, bear me a, a witness. I don't do overtime. Because I know the ministry work is awaiting me. The home job is awaiting me. Everything is awaiting And that's why you can see me for more than 2006, we come to United States and never go to Nigeria. That's part of all what I think. That okay, a lot of things have come that okay. Uh, leave ministry, concentrate on the, on school, concentrate on job, develop yourself, but are able to tell them God is the the basic thing of my life. And uh, I want to thank God he never disappointed me. And that's why you can never see me. Maybe I say I go to work on Sunday, I go to work on Monday. I didn't go to work on Monday because of Bible study. I don't go to work on Sunday because of the Sunday's activities. So I'm saying all these things so that you can know the secrets of my life and the secrets of my sources all around all around. And I pray by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, God is going to help every one of us in Jesus' name. And His grace is going to be sufficient for us. Let us ask us to pray. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Our mighty Father, we glorify your name. We thank you, Lord, because you are Lord of Lord, the King of King, the mighty one in battle. We thank you, Lord, because of your grace. We thank you, Lord, because of your abundant mercy upon us. Father, we are here once again today. Father, we know you have a dream. But deeper life, Bible Church of Charlotte, 
I pray by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, more than our expectation, you will take us to Christ in Jesus' name. And your grace is going to be sufficient for us. Thank you, Lord, because you are the Lord that answer prayer. In Jesus' name we pray. So, uh, as we remain standing, as I said all what I've said, I want everyone of us to know. When you're supposed to eat, eat when you're supposed to eat. When you were supposed to sleep, when, sleep when you're supposed to sleep. When you're supposed to work for one thing, work for what you want to support for what, that particular thing, just because of the church. And God is going to help every one of us in Jesus' name. So let's open our into in 205. In 205, a few can tell the cost. Gospel hymns and songs number 205. Gospel hymns and songs number 205. Have you counted the cost? There is a line that is drawn by rejecting our Lord, where the call of the Spirit is lost. And you hurry along with the player marked wrong. Have you counted? Have you counted the cost? You may batter your hope of eternity's money for a moment of joy at the most, for the guilt of sin and the things it will win. Have you counted? Have you counted the cost? While the door of his mercy is open to you, ere the depth of his love you exhaust, won't you come and be healed? Won't you whisper, I yield? I have counted. 